All right, what's up, guys? It is 8 in the morning, so if my voice sounds a little funny sounding, it don't sound like how I usually sound in videos. Just give me a moment. At some point in time in this video or another video, my voice will get back to normal. But anyways, no, so maybe, I don't, I think maybe it was like last week when I recorded this video or maybe even in the beginning of the week, I don't really remember. But anyways, um, there was a video that I recorded while I was talking about um, fold, this like new foldable phones called like I think the Mate XT or something like that. And so rather than, I don't have my Samsung Galaxy uh, Z Fold phone, I can't even find it, but anyways, um, but instead of it like opening up like just a normal um, Fold phone, no, this phone, it like, it's like a triple fold phone like it, it kind of like it opens up like a map almost like it's a weird phone i recommend you look it up but i do not recommend buying it because no the thing is with these phones that after some time the phone uh the peeling or not peeling but the bendable part of the phone the part that folds up the middle part um at least with my samsung galaxy z fold 4 that i have uh the last one that i had the screen peeled and then it just broke the phone and so, well, not the whole phone, but it was just that inside screen where it wasn't usable anymore. So my thing is, is this. So, all right. So actually, because I there's, I feel like there was a part that I was just about to leave off. Let me talk on this real quick. So somebody commented underneath that video trying to defend the phone. And I'm thinking to myself, fam, if in there trying to like say like, oh, pretty much like, oh, well, you do have a warranty. And I'm like, I'm not trying to spend $5 for however many times this phone goes out rather than let me just go out get an iphone keep that for a couple of years or i guess like if there is a iphone or another phone that i see that captures my eye that i'm you know i can very well but it's like with the folding phones i'm like no i'm not fooling with them because it to me that's just that's a scam where you pay 1800 16 to 1800 dollars for a phone and i can only imagine this made xt phone it's probably gonna cost a lot more than 16 um to eighteen hundred dollars but it's like you spend that much for the phone just for the phone to break on you you know like that's not a reason why i buy a phone if i'm gonna break a, if the thing is this if a phone's gonna break it better break because of me i done dropped it or just careless with it that's one thing about it is that i am not careless with any phone that i have i had to say the last time i was careless with a phone was when i was like i think yeah 14 years old and i remember i was um we were at like some assembly at my high school and so I'm sitting, this is why I be wearing zip up pockets. Like that's how extra I make sure of it. Anytime when I'm going shopping and I'm looking for pants, I always make sure I get me Adidas pants because they're the only ones that sell pants like that. But anyways, I always make sure I get pants with zip up pockets. So anyways, but no, I remember I used to wear like cargo pants, jeans, shorts. I used to just wear them all, you know, and I remember my phone. It was like sitting halfway out my pocket. I'm sitting all the way in the top bleachers. That phone fell all the way down to the um, bottom of the like bleachers and stuff. Hits the floor, probably hit a bunch of other stuff on the way down and things. And it was that fear of like checking my pockets and being like, dang, I man that that phone's cracked screens cracked phones it's gone like i'm gonna have to get me a new phone probably gonna get yelled at by my mom but anyways because she was the one that got me the phone but anyways so yeah i go down there phones perfectly intact screens not broken none of that it had a case too it was an iphone 4 it had a case I'm trying to think did it have a screen protector i can't remember if it had a screen protector but regardless though um the phone was still intact and i feel like that and my thing is this it's like that phone i feel like when I was younger, I probably wasn't um, as careful with my phones like I am today. Like when I was younger, I probably, yeah, it was like because I was dropping my phone on freaking concrete, dropped it from the bleachers, um, throwing my phone out of anger and stuff. Like, yeah, I was careless with my phone. But with that Samsung Galaxy Z Fold, for, um, Z Fold phone, I was like, bro, I was not careless with it. And that's something that I looked up online that pretty much every phone um like fold phone then came out with and i think the first one it was the outside screen but um all the other ones like from the design that they currently got now all them uh that middle part of the screen it just for some reason peels and it just breaks on people so i'm telling you guys right now like i'm doubling down on my um opinion about foldable phones 
they're not good phones. Like, yeah, they might look like they're good phones, but they're not good phones. Uh, yeah, I fell for that trade. Ended up losing out on $1,800. And that's somewhere I'm like, yeah, I could have very well just went ahead and just um, paid five bucks for the warranty phone and just could have got me another one. But I'm like, fam, I, and then it's like, okay, so I get that one. And then I'm one of those people where after some weeks, then the screen starts peeling again. And then it's like, okay, I go and spend five bucks to get another one. And then the screen um, starts peeling after some months. And then it's like, oh, then it's like another year. I ain't trying to do all that. I'm not trying to do all that at all. I'm trying to get me a phone where I can keep it. And I ain't got to worry about it breaking unless I'm the one that breaks it. But I don't be going around breaking my phones, all right? So, anyways, yeah, that's why I'm like, anybody trying to defend folding phones, I'm like, look, bro, you can like those phones if you want to. And probably whoever that person was in my comment sections probably worked for that company. But my thing is, is this, realistically, ain't nobody, don't nobody want to spend no 1800 plus dollars on a phone and then just for the phone to break on them. So that's why I'm all like, I, yesterday I was um, at Best Buy and I seen uh, the new like Z uh, Samsung Galaxy Z Fold uh, 6, I think they're on now. And I'm like, yeah, you know, it's like, it looks like a nice phone, but I know, I know that phone's true colors and I ain't trying to fool with that. So, but anyways, with that being said, I will talk to y'all later. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe if you're new to the channel and peace.